Hi, welcome back guys. Uh, time for the tasting table, the best part of the show. I'm so happy uh, that Nicholas Paul back home for a bit. National cyclist here in TNT and had some time to spend with us as he's on a very short break, not a big break, a uh, <laughs> very short break as he's getting ready uh, to go on and qualify over the next 12 months or so yeah, yeah. for Tokyo 2020. Uh, qualifying for Olympic Games is by no means an easy feat. We've had many athletes try, many athletes fail, many athletes succeed. Uh, for you, Nicholas, this is a very, very important part and time of your life. Yeah, it is, it is, because it's the main goal for me and I want to make Trinidad and Tobago to the highest point in cycling, so I just want to work hard and qualify for the Olympics. You know, as I said, many people don't realize the, the sacrifices that you guys make. Um, you know, we, we, see, we sit on the armchair, we sit on the couch and we watch and criticize. And, but it, it, it's serious sacrifice. Yeah. Um, and, 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 and sometimes I, I want to know the inspiration because many people try a professional sport and give up, you know, because they recognize yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. it's harder than how yeah. it looks. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what has been your inspiration um, uh, over, the, over the years to, to, uh, to, to keep doing what you do and, 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 and go at your goals? Uh, my main inspiration is family. Family is a big part of my life and I just want to make them happy and proud and that's my main, main inspiration behind me. Yeah. yeah. I, I just want to get one. I, I don't want the things to get cool because we worked hard on, on, on this yeah, yeah. that we made this morning. But, um, it, you switched from football to cycling, and when you switched to cycling, it, it wasn't about trying to be the next Emil Abraham or the next Michael Phillips. You, it, that, nah, it, that would be inspiration. Nah, that was the inspiration. The inspiration is just to win. <laughs> because I got a lot of licks, you might call it like that, <laughs> in my first my years of cycling. So I just wanted to win, so I started working hard, and I fell in love with cycling. So. You just want to beat people. I just want to beat people. You're, you're a winner. Yeah. You're a winner. Yeah. And uh, he now is the fourth ranked cyclist in the world by the UCI. Um, that in itself, as I said, me covering sport over the period of time, we can confirm that there has been no other TNT cyclist ranked this high um, on an international ranking. Nicholas has, has done it and he's he's really raised some eyebrows here. You were the TV6 Sport Personality of the Year. Yeah. Something that we we, we, we we be very proud of at TV6 in terms of, yeah. of doing that every year and, and, and that's an easy title to win. So <laughs> viewers have to vote yeah, for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I, I, was, I was surprised but happy at the same time yeah, yeah. to see that your supporters behind you 100% so and that trend that behind you 100% so I was really happy with that one. I think that's the most important thing. When, when that, that award that we did uh, brought viewers in, brought the fans in yeah. and it kind of really shows yeah. where the country's thinking are. and then people looking at you now. Like, yeah. Yeah, 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 and I just want to give thanks to them because yeah. without them, the backing, we wouldn't be, we wouldn't be motivated. Yeah. So I just want to give thanks to the supporters. It takes a village. Yeah. It takes a village. Um, we're very proud because we did eggs this morning. Yeah. So Nick could fry eggs, he could boil eggs, he could do a sunny side off. Yeah. Anything eggs, yeah. There were baked eggs before. We baked eggs this morning, so tomorrow, mommy and daddy get baked eggs in the morning. For sure. Right, um, we did a crustless spinach and mushroom quiche, guys. Uh, very simple, you can get your recipe on trinicooks.com. Uh, we, we, we threw eggs with whatever. You eat meat? Yeah. So the good thing about this, right, you could put your own twist on this, you know, so you see where we were layering mushroom, spinach. You could throw some ham in there, some, you know, some salmon. You know, you know talking? Yeah! yeah, yeah pro you know, more protein is better. More protein. Yeah, yeah. You could actually create whatever you want in mm -hmm. there. Throw it in the oven, 30, 40 minutes, and you get you get what we have here this morning. Let's mm -hmm. taste it. Before you go and make it for mommy, you just make sure you taste it. Right, it's it good. good, right? Yeah, we know what I hear, man. Look at this, look at this. According to Nick, we know what this is. This is good stuff. This is good stuff. Um, so I said spinach, good protein, eggs. Mm -hmm. I love mushrooms. I try to throw mushrooms in everything. I love mushrooms. So, anything I have, is, I, I don't have mushrooms in. This is good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get your recipe on Tinkles.com and check Nick out because he'll be making this at home sometime soon. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thank you very much for joining Thanks for having me, no problem. Wishing you all the very best, as I said. Anytime. The next job was an important time in your life. Um, 
we have the support of Trent Vigo, I know, right? Thanks very uh, much. And uh, Trent Vigo, if you did not know the name Nicholas Paul, now you do. And uh, let's, let's support this young cyclist. He is the fourth fastest man on two wheels. All right, that's it, TNT. Join us here back tomorrow. Thanks for taking time to share a cup with us. Remember, your weekend starts with a cup of chocolate.